If you've ever asked people what they really want and got a bit of a blank stare, then here's a tip that could be really useful. So I'm reading a book at the moment called Predictably Irrational, which is by Dan Early, and he's really talking about the fact that human behavior is very irrational, but it's predictably irrational. Anyway, when we get asked the question, what do you wanna do? Often clients get a blank look or we get a blank look, because we kind of don't know where to even start to answer the question. So what he says is that people often don't know what they want until they see someone else doing it. And I thought that's a really, really great point because often it's when you see your friends do something or other family members do something or even you see people do something on TV, it gives you that inspiration to say, yeah, yeah, that's exactly what I want. So when you are asking someone what they want, maybe one way you could reframe it is, what is something that you've seen others do that you would like to do or that you've seen others have that you would like to have? Now, of course, there's always the challenge of the keeping up with the Joneses issue and just because your mates have got a Porsche doesn't necessarily mean you need or want a Porsche. However, just by framing it that way, it can certainly start to inspire some ideas around what you want. So I've been spending the last couple of days asking people in my world, what is something that others have done that you've seen them do that has made you think, yeah, I'd love to do that. And I'm blown away by how easy that's been for them to answer versus the more generic question of, what do you really wanna do? What do you want your money for? Anyway. I thought it was a really useful tip. I really enjoyed it and I thought it might be of help to you because after all, you are valuable.